Thanks for joining us today. This tutorial shows you how to embed video in email which plays automatically at the moment of opening, just like this example. The first phase is to create your campaign within MailChimp, just as you would normally do. So we have logged into MailChimp and created a new campaign which we have named Playable Tutorial. We now select the template we wish to use. Today we're going to focus on showing you how to replace this image block with video content. To help us create our video content we will need to know the dimensions of the image block we are going to replace. To find these we click on the image and we can see the dimensions are 564 by 212. We make a note of these. Once we are happy with our template we click save and close. For now we are finished in MailChimp. We are now going to create our video content. First we'll need to log into Playable. If you don't have an account, it's free to sign up. To sign up, simply visit the Playable Get Started page. Select MailChimp and proceed to log into your MailChimp account. At this point, Playable connects to your MailChimp account to view the email templates in your MailChimp account. Once we are logged in, we are greeted with our welcome page. From here, you can administer your Playable account. Today, we're going to add a new video. So we click Videos, which takes us to our video dashboard and then we click the Add Video prompt. Firstly, we need to create a title for our video. This is for admin purposes only. We'll name ours MailChimp Tutorial. Next, we need to confirm the dimensions of the video to be displayed within our MailChimp template, as we noted from MailChimp earlier at 564 by 212. We are now ready to upload our video content to Playable. We can upload content as a video file from our computer or as a link from a hosting platform such as YouTube, Vimeo or Instagram. Today we are going to upload a file from our computer. We select File, drag our file into the specified area. The upload time will vary relative to the size of the video. During the upload, Playable creates a 10 second edit of the video as an option for you to use in your email, though in most cases you will wish to edit the video to create your own clip. Prior to editing our video, we need to select a still image, which will be shown to any recipient viewing our email on legacy Outlook email clients. We do this by selecting a frame from the video as our static image. To commence editing our video, we click Editor. Our objective is now to create the most compelling video content with a maximum duration of 10 seconds. Our video is now shown in the editor with an area framed by a dotted line. This represents the video which will be embedded within our email. We can move this area to select our preferred area of the video. To create our video email content, we select video clips from the video using the timing slider and the add click panes. We need to keep an eye on the duration of the edit, which is shown here. Once we are happy with our edit, we click continue. We now have the option to add a range of enhancements to our video. These are designed to help reinforce our messaging. We can add captions which appear at the foot of the video at time intervals we select. We can add or remove a click watermark. We can add an end card, which may be our branding or a call to action. And finally, we can include a footer with a call to action. We now click Compile. Playable now creates over 100 versions of the video. It is these which are used to deliver the very best video email experience for all recipients relative to the device and connection type on which they are viewing the email. The next step is to add our click action. We click the menu item which gives us three choices. Today we are going to redirect any recipient who clicks on the video to our website, so we add the URL and save it. We have now completed the editing of our video email clip. We can now preview our video across the major email clients and also send a sample to our colleagues for checking by simply completing the form here. We are now ready to embed the video within the MailChimp template we created earlier. To commence this we click Embed. Here we select MailChimp as our email provider. The first time you complete this process you will need to link your MailChimp account with your Playable account by adding an API key. This is covered in a separate tutorial. 
Once we have selected MailChimp, our MailChimp campaigns are shown. We select the campaign we set up earlier, Playable Tutorial. To embed our video within the template, we hover over the image we are replacing. This glows red. We then click on the image. We can now see our video within our template. To send this template with our video embedded to our MailChimp account, we click Create New Campaign, followed by a click on the prompt, click to view your new campaign in MailChimp. We have now successfully embedded our video into our MailChimp template and we continue to test and send our MailChimp campaign in the normal way. Thanks for watching and please get in touch with any further questions.